Hey guys, uh, I just heard something in the bushes, but I'm going to keep going anyway. Uh, I made some homemade sliding gloves, and I'm going to teach you how to make them, because they're not that pretty, but they work, and they work for a few days, and then you just have to retape them, and they'll work forever, pretty much, because they're really thick. So the only way of really hurting yourself is the wrist, unless you want to add some extra stuff on it. And so here's, here they are, one second. Gotta move them in place, gotta be perfect. Alright, so these are the slide gloves. They are three pieces, obviously, four, including the glove. And so what I did was I just added... Okay, so if you have a hockey puck, they cost like a buck each, two bucks, something like that. Uh, just some, any gloves that are quite a bit thicker, like these Rona gloves are fine. They're like, I would recommend these gloves because they're very thick and fine. They're comfy. And yeah. So, uh... Yeah, so if I'm going to be teaching you how to make them, you have to add a puck in the palm so that you can easily slide on it. Right there, and then the thumb needs to be taped around while... Oh, by the way, uh, when you tape it to the, the glove, make sure your hand's in the glove so that it's not too tight when you wear it. See, I can easily fit it in. Uh... By just putting in my hand and, you know. The only bad problem about these gloves is that you can't grab very well. Unless you can just go, eh. Yeah, but, um, yeah, these are the gloves. And, uh, yep. Um, so if you want, use this method. And these will probably last forever because this is super, super thick. You can chop it down a little bit. Oh, yeah, I, I forgot to tell you guys how to uh, cut the pucks. And what you need to do is grab a telescopic yard work thingy. My bob. Seriously, I'm not kidding. It's one of these. And you put the puck in the blade, sort of. One second, let me show you. Alright. So, as you can see here, blah, blah, blah. That's the pressure thing. And that's the blade. It's pretty sharp. Uh, Alright, so now I'll be showing you a couple slides with the gloves. And if you're doubting this technique... This will prove you otherwise, because I'm about to show you right now. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to put on my gloves, and I'm going to do it with the skateboard, because my longboard, it's not very good on this kind of pavement stuff. That's really smooth and slippery. And, well, it's not that slippery. It's kind of rough. So, yeah. Uh, you'll see uh, that the gloves really work. And it's kind of stylish, no? Okay, well, yeah, I'm going to try it. Thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed.